It was week six of the 2019 high school football season. For many teams, just another Friday night under the lights. But for the Federal Hawking Lancers, it would mark a significant turning point. A string of injuries reduced their roster to so few players that the Lancers had to forfeit the rest of that season's games. I felt like it wasn't fair to like everybody, the coaches, the staff, the people that are supporters, just everybody. It was just the latest in a series of hardships. For the five years prior, the Lancers had won only one game, long haunted by a 40-game losing streak. And in 2020, Federal Hawking left the Tri-Valley Football Conference in favor of smaller school matchups. Despite picking up two wins, the team only played a mere five-game season, once again forfeiting their final weeks. Still, hope remained among the Fed Hawk faithful. At the end of the day, I just feel like as a family, as a unit, uh, we still had the most heart out of any teams. The future of the program was in question. Incoming students just weren't joining the team. It looked like FedHawk would have to join the smattering of Ohio schools that are moving to eight-man football. That's when they hired Coach Brad Woodson. Woodson has coached Ohio football for decades, serving as an early mentor for NFL stars Le'Veon Bell and Dwayne Smoot. He believes this team has the talent, the resources, and the heart to succeed. But what they've been missing? To me, I see, I see value. I see relationship building, which in turn is going to bring people out. That's all it is. Not running them to death, not saying you're not any good, positive things. That's what it's all about. You know, this right here, this is positive. They're saying, oh, coaches hang out jerseys? Not folded in a tote? With the help of Coach Woodson, the Lancers were able to press on with a traditional 11-man season. For now, his focus is on completing the 2021 year, but he hasn't forgotten about paving the road ahead. Now, those eighth graders, God willing, I have them for four years. And every year, I'm teaching them a little bit more about the field. What's that going to happen? What's going to be like when they're sophomores and juniors? That's how you go to program. Something, oh, I need a quarterback. I need a running back. No, you have everything you need right around you. If you know how to build it. 